Hello guys, in this video I will teach you how to sell in OpenSea using Polygon Chain without paying any gas. Because uh, from a previous video I got a lot of questions asking about how we list for sale in OpenSea for free without paying any gas. So I think this one is the solution for you, it's using Polygon Chain. And also I will uh, tell you what is the pros and cons or advantage and disadvantages of using Polygon Chain for selling your NFT in OpenSea. So without further ado, let's get started. So in order to sell on Polygon Chain, first you need to make some configuration to your MetaMask. You can click on your MetaMask icon extension in your Google Chrome and then you can see your first mainnet is Ethereum mainnet. So if you are in Ethereum mainnet, you may not able to sell in Polygon Chain. So in order to sell in Polygon Chain, you need to add custom RPC. And custom RPC, this one is we need to add the chain. The chain is uh, look like a bank or look like a network protocol. So you need to make some configuration to your MetaMask to add to add Polygon Chain. So in order to add this, you can go to the main documentation of Matic Developer. I will put the link down below. You need to follow this this uh, instruction. You just copy it, copy it, right? You can do exactly the same thing like this. Matic mainnet, everything here. Chain ID 137 Matic or something. And then you can copy and pass from here as well. So and then you will, uh, after you make custom RPC already, you will see the Matic mainnet here. This is uh, the chain that you need to choose. You need to choose like which chain you are using. So this one is Ethereum mainnet. So you need to use Matic mainnet. Okay. After you add custom RPC already, you can click save and it will directly add you into your network. So right now I am in Ethereum mainnet. So in order to send in Polygon chain, you need to select here Matic mainnet. So I just close this because right now I have like 0 0.0694 Matic already. Because uh, Matic is quite cheap and the gas fee is very cheap. Like transfer money and everything is very cheap in Polygon chain. I'm very very uh, encourage you if you want like a very cheap gas free and it also come with the pros and cons also. So you need to choose Matic mainnet and then uh, you can see right now I am on Matic mainnet. Make sure it is very important and then you log in. Log into OpenSea already because I think mostly people already uh, have experience in Ethereum mainnet I, so I don't think you are very confused about choosing the chain or anything but what you need to do is just choose as I say it Matic mainnet and then click on your profile and my collection you just click my collection and then you need to create your collection your and then putting your logo image or your collection feature image banner and giving an example of it like the name giving the name and it, this is like it just asked me how to change anything signature just sign it right just sign okay Let's see yeah right and then just put the url or if you don't have no need to put the url also the description of your collection add category what is your category maybe collectible also and also if you have your site or discord or twitter just put it here and also the royalty i i, I want i want to emphasize a little bit about royalty royalty it means that you can read the uh, description collect a fee when a user resell so it means that when people resell when they buy your nft already and then they resell it you what percentage you want right so if I, I would like like three three percent every resale I will got two percent so this one is your payout wallet address you just uh, go to your metamask and then copy copy your your address and put it here so this is your payout wallet address so every every time when people resell they will money into your payout wallet address but maybe you need to wait a little bit like one week or two or three weeks it's up to the open sea and also in the blockchain this is very important in order to sell in polygon chain you need to choose this to this one polygon right click here and ethereum 
and click and choose Polygon. So in Polygon, you can sell in Ethereum. We don't need to sell in Matrix or anything. People sometimes they think like, okay, when we sell in Polygon, we need to uh, put the price in Polygon or uh, in Matrix. It, it's not. It's not like that. You can put like Ethereum. It's up to you also. DAI or maybe USDC. It's up to you, right? And then you just hit content and then the create button will be uh, active when you complete all of this. So in my case, I already have the collection and right now I just this video just to teach you how to sell in Polygon chain without paying any gas. So when you click create, the MetaMask will pop up for you to sign. So you just sign it and accept it and like just click approve OK something like that. Just click it. It's very easy for Matrix and then you need no need to pay any gas. After you have your collection already. So right now I have sell in both Ethereum uh, chain and also in Polygon chain. I have sell in both chain already. So for example, I have like this called the Ethereum. This the e Ethereum is selling in Polygon chain right now. Uh, you can see right now I have make some sell like this one. Why? How do you know that one NFT is selling on Polygon or Matrix? You, you can see here, you can go and hover the icon, this one, you can see blockchain polygon, right, right now you can see blockchain polygon. So it means that it is selling in polygon chain right now. So this is my collection. This collection, I purposely selling it in polygon chain. So the price is quite cheap. You can support me by, by going to buy here right now. Uh, what is the pros and cons of, of uh, selling in polygon? So first, I would uh, I talking about the disadvantage or or cons of the selling in Polygon chain. First, there is seem to not hype, you know, you know, have a uh, big collector, not seem not much in Polygon chain in Polygon's uh, network, because since I see mostly most of the big sell is selling in Ethereum chain, in Ethereum chain, like you can see CryptoPunk or Ether Rocks or another big player, another big collection. Mostly they're making sale in Ethereum chain. So this is what you need to keep in mind. Most of the collector, they are more into Ethereum chain. So, but also it comes with the advantages. When you sell in Polygon, first you need no need to pay any gas. So, and also the creator, when they are the big, the big buyer in Ethereum, so most of the talented people, creative people, and most of the big, big creators, they focus on Ethereum. So in Polygon, you might have more opportunity because you be, be a target to some of the uh, buyer who not likely to pay any gas. So in Polygon, I would like to tell you, if someone buy your NFT, they pay zero gas, zero gas fee. You know what I mean? Because they no need to pay any gas. So I would tell you some example of my experience selling in Ethereum. My NFT selling like for three USD, three USD, three dollar, but they need to pay the gas in order to buy my NFT. They need to pay like 20, 20 baht or 20 USD, right? So it sum up like 23, 23 dollar in order to buy my NFT. So this is like a lot also. So this is one uh, advantage that I think you, if you n don't want to invest much on the gas, so you can sell in your uh, Polygon chain. So I think this is it. So after you have the, your collection, you just add item, right? Right now you can add item and then you put uh, the image or any file. Right now the supporting file is quite a lot like JPEG, PNG, GIF, SVG, MP4, MP3, Wave, OGG, GLB, GTF, a lot, but a lot. So you can just like choose whatever chain. You can see right now it's Polygon. Right now in everything, it, uh, I think this is like almost the end of the video already. So you can follow through. And also I want to tell you something. When someone want to buy, want to buy, if you are the buyer in uh, Polygons, you want to buy my assets in Polygons, First, you need to also have Matic Manage also in order to buy, in order to buy from 
polygon chain you need to have matrix magnet also and then you need to have like uh, your your eth your ethereum in matrix magnet in order to buy from 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 me in order to buy the collection from polygon so you need to buy you want to buy just click here and then you click buy and you don't need to pay any cards what one thing i just figured out is that this is like it put in like the uh, cell and in right this one i am it quite confusing in in polygon chain because i think like if uh, the cell and so your asset will not be sell anymore will not be listed right so this is what you need to keep in mind so it's not that important because i i can sell it right now so one more thing when someone buy when someone buy uh, from your your collection and then you you not see you not see in your metamask or, or any coin any coin that you have in matrix but you not see it here so you just click on this option and then click on view in uh, explorer and then you can see here it is called token token is mean that how many asset how many token how many coin that you have in this polygon chain with your public address so right now when you click drop down you can see i have a lot of token that i'm not added added yet in metamask so this is not that important it if you not see your coin here it doesn't mean that you have lose all your coin no you need to know that so i just click here just click here in order to, to add in order to add and then i copy i copy this contract right i can click copy and then go to my metamask and also i can add token and then pass pass the token it will generate for me right now i have weth it is a uh, the same as ETH WETH it means wrap Ethereum so it is equal to Ethereum as well you don't need to be to be very very uh, confusing about this I want you to know WETH is equal to ETH but it just give it the uh, different name because it is not in Ethereum chain so that's why they call it wrap Ethereum okay you just click add next and then click add token so if you coming back, you can see right now I have 0 0.0694 matrix and also 0 0.003 WETH right now. I have some kind of that. Uh, another thing, if you want to cash out, cash out it means that you want to get your your money as the uh, USD to pay for anything, right? You need to have your cash. So you just go to quick swap and also you need to have matic also the matic i think it not that expensive you can buy it from buy by none and transfer it to your to your address to your address right this is the public address you can see it here you can um, transfer from buy none you buy uh, matics and then transfer it here it's very cheap for matics right now and you have matic you need to go to quick swap and then just connect just connect it to your mate with your metamask and then you click choose here after you have like uh, ethereum so in order to cash out you need to convert it to matrix right now because only matrix accepted on polygon chain in binance if you want to transfer your matrix to binance because if you are using eth you cannot transfer directly the ethereum cannot transfer directly to polygon chain using using uh using mm, polygon chain cannot cannot transfer directly so you need to convert it to matrix so this part you need to uh, exchange from ethereum to matrix and then you just click on add, add amount right now i have like 8.72443 matrix and then i just click swap so and, and then i need to accept the payment or anything just accept it and wait a little bit because it takes time and after you have your matrix and then you can transfer you can click on matic and then click send and then put in your public your public address of binance so in binance you need to deposit matic you, you go to your binance and then deposit matic and then choosing matic mainnet choosing polygon mainnet okay you need to choose but uh, matic mainnet or polygon mainnet in order to get your money otherwise your money will be lose all your money okay and then you will have the uh, public address and then put it here and just click accept and transfer so that's it you can have your 
matrix in Binance and then you convert it to USD. You can sell your matrix on Binance and then cash out. So I think this is it. Seem all in this case, and I want to tell you some of the sell selling in uh, OpenSea. You have a lot of option in selling. So in in this case. In Polygon chain, I think it's very easy if you want to give, you want to give your your NFT to someone else. You just click it here, transfer, and then put in your uh, destination address, your your friend address or your 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 family address. Put it here that you want to send them. Just put it here and then click transfer. And sometimes it fail. The 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 transfer is fail. I don't know as well what happened. So you just do like that. Also in Ethereum mainnet, you you can mint it. You can upload your photo publicly in OpenSea, and then if you don't want to list for sale because you don't have any gas to pay, you just waiting for someone uh, offer you offer you the price for your asset for your NFT. So if someone offer you the, uh, that, you if you uh, click accept, you need to pay for the gas. Remember, you need to pay for the gas every offering. You need to pay for the gas, and the gas is quite expensive, as you all know, right? The gas in each minute, you need to pay for the gas in order to sell. So why not you pay for one time and then sell it forever? As me right now, I have like, I have paid for one time and then sell it forever. So I think this video is quite on. You come to the end of the video, and thank you so much for. Uh, for watching my video till the end and also if you have any question you can drop down uh, comment down below and I can answer all of the questions so see you in the next video